guys, welcome to my channel. I'm here at Walmart in Northern Michigan. Checking out, see how the food supply, sorry about the finger, uh, looks all for the holidays on Memorial Weekend. And uh, are, are the shoppers gonna have any trouble finding what they are looking for? So ride along with me. <laughs> it does look like the Faygo uh, sodas and, and the uh, Great Value Sands products are just about wiped out so just a few over here a few others over on the other side here but you know they're the more expensive brands so you know your Faygo and Great Value brands are always the first to go normally because a lot of people don't want to pay that price right there for Coca-Cola you know it just seems like an awful lot are still a great price, so that's good to see. Still 6 out 2 for the 60 out. Over here to Great Value Better, it's still $3.98. $4.98 for the Lander Lakes. Tilbrook Cheese, $5.28. So it looks like it's looking pretty good today. Plenty of butter to go around, and the price hasn't come up either. Milk is looking real good, home at $2.76 a gallon. And uh, looks like we have plenty of milk to go around. Yeah, we even have some chocolate milk, 276. That sounds really good right now. If you're looking for a salad, you don't want to make your own, 397. And you can have them made for you already for both the potato salad and the uh, home style coleslaw. I don't see any of the macaroni salad though. Plenty of cheese to go on those burgers if you're going to grill burgers to 48 from the Great Value brand. And plenty of cheese, you know, here. So the cheese looking good. They have the, these here for $2 uh, for the 8 ounce. So those are good with crackers. Now you know you are a true Michigander if you eat pickled bologna. And those are $16.22 for those now. I sure would like to have one though. Over here, six forty-four can get you the Kohler's VNS. So those have definitely come up in price. Let's see how the chip aisle is looking. And I am definitely seeing some gaps along in the chips. So that's telling me probably more people are uh, going to be eating outside, maybe and barbecuing. So there are a few gaps. 384 for the Oscar Meyer cheese hot dogs and 250 for the regular pack. Those come down. That's gonna be very good. They have a uh, lower price on the Oscar Meyer hot dogs. So that's a good thing right before the holidays when people like to grill hot dogs. Ballpark or 397, a little bit more price here. And the Hebrew Dashel are 487. And these big boys here, those are $8.68. There's your hot dog. And then some. Well, let's see how the cereal's looking. Two fifty for the, uh, they have that marked down. Chocolate crunch, two fifty. I like to watch for those kind of stickers right there. And... There's a few gaps going on, you know, but most of the cereal, the price of it has just gone up. Ridiculous. Six twenty-eight for Fruit Loops. The mega size. Fruit Loops, six twenty-eight. <laughs> no. They've always been kind of pricey, but wow, that's a lot. Great value bad for a dollar forty-eight. That's that's more like, you know, down to earth for me. Um and 4 93 for the Cheerios family size. If you're looking to make any pancakes, well, we have a few gaps. $1.98 on the great value, four ninety eight for the bigger one, five pounds of it. And the Poutine's Belgian, two seventy six. Now that sounds really good, but you might need syrup. Uh, 236 for the great value, six ninety eight for log cabin, Miss Butter where it's 412. And Maple Grove, 318. But if you are looking for pure maple syrup, 1598. 
So, yeah. That's very expensive, that good. 568 for the Quaker Oats and 248. We'll get you the 18 ounce Quaker Oats. Or not Quaker. Oh my goodness. Great value brand. How about that? And 568 for the Quaker. I'll be alright. I promise. We're going to make these s'mores. The great value graham crackers are 212. Or you can get the cinnamon kind for 212. And the honey made, 458. But I wonder how many people are making s'mores. That sounds really good to me. These are kind of, they're $1.44 now, but just that water. If you are going camping, they're great <clears throat> to not only put on your proper pantry, but, uh, you know, just said water if you're going to have, like, potatoes, you know, while you're camping. Really convenient. Or you can get these down here for 98 cents. Um, we have Idaho in, in the box for 230 And empty spot there. And we have one great value, instant mashed potato. All yours, right there. A few empty gaps on the mac and cheese. Mac and cheese. Poor lonely wheat thins box there, or crackers. Uh, a few gaps, but there is some mac and cheese that you can choose from. These are 50 cents a box. Compared to the craft, a dollar a box. A dollar or 50 cents. A dollar or 50 cents. So we do have salt now, 64 cents each on the salt, and plenty of salt and pepper, and spices are now a dollar eighteen for the ground cinnamon, and the chili a dollar twelve. So cinnamon's a little bit more, and the red peppers are a dollar forty-four. Looks like they're different prices, just depending on what you're looking for. Two ninety four for the four pounds of sugar, but that is all we have right there. Not looking so great, and that is all we have for the ten pounders at six forty seven. So I hope y'all are getting your sugar. Flour is two twenty four. Twelve for the five pounders, looking pretty good on the flour. Look at the price on the Wesson thirteen forty four for the kind of Wesson nine twelve for the great value of canola oil. And 524 for the vegetable. Looks like 364 for the one quart. Or 48 fluid ounces, I guess. Of the vegetable oil. 524 for the lesson. Canola oil. Pastas are looking a little bit uh, shy on the shelves today. 98 cents for them. Maybe more people are making pastas. But I'm not sure, but. <laughs> A lot less of the pasta. The gorilla, a dollar eighty-four. So, yeah, haven't seen it that slim in a while. Tuna fish, three forty-six for a four pack, or ninety-two cents for a single. Two twelve. If you want to get this one right here, and a dollar sixty-three for starfish. Definitely four twenty-two for that one. Definitely, it's got up the price. Come over here to the peanut butter, three ninety eight for the uh, great value. Still for the two pounders, and we do have some gaps there. Six seventy eight for the Jeff. Uh, but uh, yeah, a little bit of a few gaps going on, and same thing with the jelly. Just a few hit and miss gaps going on. <laughs> Ketchup for Heinz, $4.48, $1.98 for ounce. That one is good. $6.98 for that big tall Heinz. Figured I'd come over to the meat real quick. We do have some sparrows here. And those are $11.89 a pound. $23.07 for that one right there. Well, let me know in the comments if you're going to have sparrows this weekend. Here they have some of these pre-made burgers, uh, $13.32, $14.82, and $11.82, looks like, or you can get them in the box, I'm not sure how much these are. Angus beef burgers, 
42. I guess these are 26 87. So, right here you can get some ribeye at 13.97 a pound. That one is 2.7 ounces for 37.72. What a price, huh? This is a chuck pot roast. 6.97 a pound. That's only 2.78. Pounds for 19.38. They do have brats on sale for 4.78 of the Johnsonville uh, brats. So whether you like the cheddar or the bear or the original 4.78. These are 3.22 a pound. That's 322 pound it looks like for these spare ribs. Maybe they're the same one. I'm not sure. I thought roast for three. Oh, let me look. That is a dollar eighty-eight a pound for the bottom side. Then we have some pork chops over here. Three sixty-eight a pound, two point five six for nine forty-two. And for chicken, it looks like the chicken is. Oh, I can't see very well. Uh, two ninety-seven a pound, <laughs> and that's five point eight. 17.46 for the chicken breast over here. You can get some wings for 2.98 a pound. That's 14.96. We got pack for the chicken wings, chicken legs. We're gonna run you 6.46 for that pack. A dollar 42 a pound for the chicken legs. It looks like coffee is staying at 12.98 for the Folgers. Well guys, time for me to head out of here. Uh, if you enjoyed the video, give me a thumbs up and subscribe. And hope you all have a terrific Memorial Day weekend. Until next time, to look at us. See you in the next video.